This is not financial advice, it's not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all the YouTube algorithm and stuff. See the videos I put them out, see what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell y'all every day, that data they release us is false. I'm going to give us a false narrative market to keep us off balance, mess with us psychologically. Listen, the shorts are in a dire situation. They have nowhere to turn, and it's going to get a whole lot worse. And while they have to worry about retail investors, they have other concerns. Because here's the thing. If AMC gets in a collaboration with Disney or Amazon, the shorts have to cover all those shares. The shorts have to cover all those shares. Their only hope was AMC going bankrupt or retail selling their shares. And I'm sure by now, even though they st they still stepping up the FUD articles, they're stepping up the shows in the chat rooms, they have come to accept the fact that we are not selling We've been holding for two years. We didn't sell at 72. We're definitely not selling at 550 or six dollars. So they have accepted the fact that we are not selling. Their only other way out was for AMC to go bankrupt. And as we know by all the fundamentals, by all the movie releases, by all the strategic moves that Adam Aaron has been doing, reducing the debt, hike forth mining, the advertisements. The, the the credit cards, um, releasing Netflix in the movie theaters. I mean, the likelihood of AMC going bankrupt is almost impossible at this point. But here's the other thing that they have to be concerned about. There are big whales laying in the cut, as we would say. You have big whales laying in the cut and when they see these guys starting to cover they're gonna jump in and buy probably millions of amc shares and really hurt these shorters and they know that don't think that all these hedges work together don't think all these hedges are friends these guys are sharks they are in there to make money. So I'm sure there's a lot of hedge funds or a lot of whales that are sitting on the sidelines waiting for the right time to pounce. And when they do, they're going to hurt those shorters even more. Probably a lot more than the retail investors. So at this point... There's no way out for them. They're in a very precarious situation. And the only way this ends is with the market collapsing and AMC and GME apes receiving the attendees and we see a generational transfer of wealth. And maybe at that point, the SEC might start doing their job and we might see some of these criminals in handcuffs. Who knows? Anyway, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm and stuff, and tell me what you think about these hedges and dire financial situation and the whales waiting on the sidelines to pounce and hurt them even more. Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.